Welcome, everybody. Thanks for joining us again for another Big Blue Dive Lights video. I'm Christina Baker. This is Tyler Hall. We are your people here in the U.S. We're going to go over today video lights. And mm. if you can believe it, this is a portion yes. of our video lights Not that we're focusing them. on today so that we don't completely confuse you with our entire line of video lights. We've chosen the ones that um, are pretty much our most popular ones, the ones that have been around a while, uh, super reliable. They all come with lithium ion rechargeable batteries. They all come with replacement O-rings. Yep. They all come with one inch ball mounts. Yep, yep. And you can see the differences visually here. Some of them have built in blue. Yes. So obviously the ones with the blue rings at the top, those are gonna have built in LED blue lights. Yes. Uh, another thing that they all have in common, they also have built in red lights. Um, obviously this helps with your photo video work and it's also cool because you can sneak up on creatures that can't see that red light. Yes. So get right up on them and then blast them with your, uh, with your video lights up. <laughs> uh, what we recommend as a starting point, if you're just getting going with video, you got your little GoPro going. This is our 1800 lumen, 120 degree video light. This is the AL1800 XWP. We call this a black molly. There's two, or I guess three versions now. Yep, yep. But they start at 1800 lumens and you can see the beam angle, super wide, 120 degrees, and there's no hard edge. And you'll notice that on all of these lights. Yep. So this, again, would be what we would recommend, absolute starting point, 1800 lumens, 120 degree wide beam. That's the Black Molly 1800 XWP. The step up from that is another Black Molly. It's a 2600 lumen. Yep. Um, and then there's also one with a built-in LED, or built-in blue LED, and that's what this guy is right here. Yep, yep, yep. And then starting going up from there yep. would got, be... Got the 4600, the VL 4600P uh, would be the one right below this. This one has the built-in blue light because that blue ring around it. Um, so yeah, 4600 lumens on high. It's got the four power settings. Got the battery indicator on the light head there. 120 degree extra wide angle beam, like she said already. <laughs> And that is Diver Dan. Welcome to the party, Diver Dan. So you can see the difference in the lumens. I'm gonna go from this 2600 yep. lumen on Diver Dan and then same distance there. So yeah. you've got, you know, about twice the lumens in that guy. Yeah. Yep, so um, this is this is uh, definitely a step up from that, but this is a perfect light as a starter too, mm -hmm. if you're looking at you know, cry once, buy once type of deal. This is, <laughs> this this could be, you know, a uh, very, very good starter light as well. Yeah, definitely. So. This is the VL6200P. This came out, I believe, this last year in 2023. Yep. It's just starting to, uh, to take off in sales for us. Sometimes things, newer lights, they take a little bit longer. You know, we don't have those reviews built up and people are unsure. But I assure you, it's built the same as all of our other lights. I would consider this a really good mid-range yeah. light. So we'll get you the, the view on that one. Yeah. So 6200 lumens, same 120 degree wide angle, no hard edges, yeah. you can see. So it's again, it's going to be perfect for those GoPro situations. Maybe even a little step up from that, you getting into the the TL, uh, what is it, the TLG? Um, no. The, uh, the what's it called, the T7 or... Um, TG6, TG7. Yeah. Yes, that. <laughs> Again, these guys, we don't know, we don't know cameras, we only know like... Um, 
that would be a perfect mate for for in kind of those mid-level cameras yeah and then moving on from there this guy's a little different this is a vl 9000 tc and when we say tc that means tri-color so this guy is going to have three settings of cool white and then three settings of warm white so I'm going to show you the difference as I scroll through here. So again, three settings of cool white, three settings of warm white. So here we go. Same uh, 120 degree wide beam, 9,000 lumens. I know we're running through things very quickly here. Yes. So here we go. One, two, three of cool, and then one, two, three of warm. Yep. So the cool light is 6,500 Kelvin and the warm light is 5,000 Kelvin. Mm -hmm. This light also has red built into it as well. Mm -hmm. If you double click that button, it should go into the red mode. Go. Um, and then one click out will put you right back at the top, top uh, cool white light mode. Right. So yeah. it's very versatile light. Um, you know, that, that warm light can be really uh, good for kind of getting like a daytime effect underwater. Yeah. Um, it's, it's very, very um, highly popular light that, mm -hmm. that we offer there. Mm -hmm. um, so going up from there, we got the VL11000 PBRC. Right. Um, so this light has um, just the same 120 degree wide angle beam, 11,000 lumens on high. It's got the four power settings, and then it also has that fluorescent blue setting built into it as well. Um, the RC on the very end of the nomenclature is, it stands for remote control. So this, this light has a optical fiber port, which can be used to remote control the light from like a camera um, tray arm. We sell a remote controller that will hook into this with from an optical fiber cable and you can get the same bu uh, button functionality from that remote control. Um, so that is an amazing way to have your light kind of positioned up and you can just control it very easily from your tray handle. Yeah. So. Good call. This yeah. one also comes in just a regular VL11000P yep. without the blue, without the remote control. Yes. So a little bit less expensive than this. If you don't need all the bells and whistles, you still get that 11,000 lumen power. And this is really honestly just even here, it's the first time it's really like, boom, you see that power behind it in the yeah. lumens. Very strong, yes. very strong light. So now we're getting into the upper end of, of video lights. Yep. So from here and these guys down, these all come with dry bags. Yes. And then starting here, they're gonna come with a hard case. Yep. So next we move on to the VL11000 PBRC. Again, the RC, noting the remote control. 18,000, sorry. Oh, sorry. 11,000. Oh, no, we're going up, we're going up. Sorry about that. Um, so yeah, we've got the port here and you do not need to use the optical fiber for the remote control. If you wanna go without remote control use, this is totally fine to use in the water. Yep. Without that, totally safe, it's yep. sealed. Mm -hmm. We get a lot of questions about that. Yeah. So I'm going to turn this one on, watch yourself. Close your it's eyes. get even brighter, <laughs> even bouncing off Diver Dan. Yeah. It's bright. Yeah. So, that's so, yeah. Got that 120 degree wide Actually, angle. Actually 160 on 160. this one. 160, yeah. yep. So you get, you get wider. This is the one that it jumps up on everything. Yes. 160, 18,000 lumens. And then I'll, I'll scroll through the settings for you so you can see where that blue kicks in. Nice. So again, super bright, even on the blue. And then if we double tap it, you get that red, that built in. So no messing with filters on this one. Yeah. Straight up, it's all in the settings. It's all in one push button. So there's one point of failure entry if anything does go wrong. That's yeah. the reason we get asked that question so many times. I wish there were more buttons. And honestly, sometimes, 
user friendly wise that what would make more sense except that fail rate we want to eliminate every possible scenario in water intrusion exactly yep and what you know once you get to know this this light the the one button makes sense because you can just sit there and push that one button until you get it to the right setting yeah and you know most of the time when you're when you're using it too you you'll go back to the same settings because yeah. you find your sweet spot yeah when you're shooting um, yeah, it becomes second nature very quickly. Yes. Yep. Yep. So moving on to this big bad boy, we got the VL36000 PBRC. So similar, same, really the same functions as that light that we just showed you, the 18,000, but this one is amped up. It's twice the power of that. Um, it comes um, in a protective case, just like the 18,000. It's got that built-in blue light. It's got the cool white color temperature, uh, 21700 by eight battery in there, and you can get replacement batteries for that. Um, comes with the double O-ring seal, extra O-rings in the box. So let's crank this puppy up. All right, don't get blinded. Watching myself. <laughs> 120 oh. to, or sorry, 160 degree wide angle beam. It's got um, those power settings so you can go in half and you go to the blue. And it's got three power settings on the blue, mm -hmm. then it will shut off. You double click that button, it's gonna go into red. And then click one more, go to the highest setting, wait two seconds, it shuts off. This is, this is what I like to call the manta ray light too. Mm -hmm. Out in Hawaii, this is the light that they use to get the manta rays to come up on their snorkel tours. Very, very cool, powerful light. Um, we also do this light without the built-in blue, um, without uh, the remote control setting. So that's just the VL36000P. Um, so yeah, if you don't want all the, like, the bells and whistles like Christina said, you can go for that one. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, super professional photography, videography style light there. Um, and we do have one bigger that yes. we did not bring out today. <laughs> uh, it is 65,000 lumens. Yes. So if anybody is interested in that, um, call me. Yeah. <laughs> I'd be happy to go over the uh, specs on that yes. with you. Yep. So that's it for our video lineup. Yes. And I think next time we'll do. We're going to probably do the CB. The CB. Yeah. So more video lights to come. If that's your ball game, yep. we're going to introduce you to our CB lights or chip on board lights. Uh, and we'll talk about that next time. So keep watching and have a good one. Awesome. Thank you guys. Please remember to like, share, and uh, subscribe to our channel. Uh, this is the official Big Blue channel for the U.S. So thank you guys so much. Thanks, guys.